Hey guys, I'm Petty and today I want to show you the Gibson Les Paul Studio and a black cherry burst. But first of all, I show you the specs, clean the guitar, put new strings on it and then we go over to the sound samples. Les Paul Studio 2017. Very nice model. I like the finish and um, yes, it's not the color, um, the same color you get in this price section for about $700-$800. dollars. The studios have a warm, warm brown finish or things like this. It's very nice. But later in the conclusion, we can talk about things. Okay, I play a couple of clean chords and then we go over to these things LS Paul is made for. It's rock. Okay, hasta luego. <laughs>
Gibson Les Paul Studio T. Let's go over to the conclusion. If we look at the versatility of this guitar, you can't do more because you have cold split, you have nice humbuckers and you can play everything. So, five points. In the matter of workmanship, I give two and a half points to Gibson because if you look at the fretboard, let me show here. Look here. A bit wood is missing, and uh, this is not okay. For this price, it's totally not okay. And if you look here, between the between these two things, I hope you see it. It's not. <laughs> it's not good workmanship. Yes, um, and if we l take a closer look to the back, you can't read made in the USA. You can't read it. That is not cool, Gibson. Um, workmanship, two and a half points. Can't give more points. Okay, the price performance ratio. For that, we have to compare the costs of this guitar. It's very expensive. Then the workmanship. And on the other side, the versatility and the playability. Um, when we put all together, I can give three points because for this price, it's it's no good workmanship, so three points. In the overall rating, I give four points to the Gibson S. Paul Studio T because if you don't buy a new one, uh, if you buy it at Reverb or whoever, it's totally okay because they are, they are totally good sounding humbucker with cold split and a massive Les Paul sound, and I love Les Paul sounds. It's well balanced on the lap or on the strap, it's, it's totally okay. And what I like are these tuners. I don't like the vintage one, so that's a, <laughs> that's a good point for me. <laughs> but uh, I think f four points overall, it's, um, it's, it's totally good for this guitar, but I would buy it at Reverb or whoever, not new. <laughs> okay, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm Patty and I say hasta luego, tschüss und goodbye.